Okay, welcome back. Here's a, another update for you. Um, the dog clutch idea we've decided to scrap because the alignment has to be so true uh, that could actually lead to problems later on if it uh, if there's a big load on it and it starts to bend the shaft. Uh, it obviously causes lots of problems. So, luckily, the technology is now out. Um, Hobby King have brought out this 100 amp controller, forward and reverse, but it's censored. So uh, uh, the problem with, that we had was there was no censored motors big enough uh, for this project. So what we've done, we've taken our original Turner G, we've put a plastic ring around it, and located around the ring hall sensors at 120 degree increments. Those hall sensors go to this sensor unit, which we stole out of a censored motor. They send it to the controller, uh, and then it, uh, it eradicates all that cogging problems that we have. Now, today, we've got quite a big load. We've got four carriages on. Okay, no one's sitting on it, but uh, there's four carriages. It's quite a weight. And as you see, when we start the controller up, no cogging whatsoever. It's very smooth indeed. So there you go. We've totally eradicated the problems that we had before. Still, still got the braking. So yeah, same motor, which is a three horsepower motor. We're running on 100 amps, so we we are underpowering it, but it's plenty of power for this project, and uh, we've eradicated the, prob the cogging problems. So uh, I'll put the details in the description of the video. We're going to get rid of the DC motor and we're going to have a shorter belt drive from the brushless motor straight down to the lay shaft so we get rid of this uh, DC motor and that will uh, also stop the drag that's happening on here so it will be very free running so uh, yeah I look forward to updating you guys again and uh, look out for the next video and uh, we'll do another test run once this is in place correctly thanks for watching